Holy Sunday. It's dress down day. And we're going to make noodles for raviolis. And we got it on set in one. But it's not coming through all the way. You gotta push it. I don't want to get my fingers. It ain't gonna get your fingers. Okay. Then fold it over once. Yeah. Like this? Yeah, because it's still got a lot of holes. It needs to be worked nice and smooth. Once it starts getting smooth, it's you still can on go number to one. Yeah. Fold it over again until it gets nice and smooth and get edged, and it comes all the way out to the sides. It's kind of like working the dough. Yeah. See, that looks nice. Now you can put the setting two. Okay. That was about three times on that? On one? Yeah. Right? One always takes the longest. Right? We're on setting two. Mm -hmm. Fold it over. Yes. So it looks pretty. Does that single to the next one? Yeah, you can go right to the next one. Do not fold it for the next one, though. Just feed it in thin. Oh. You don't want to fold it for the next one. It makes it too thick. I just took it in. That's fine. It's working it through. You can run it through that a couple of times. That looks pretty good. Don't it look? Yeah, that's very nice. So you just go to the next setting. Right. Twice on three. Cheese somewhere. Huh? What? I put the cheese away. You need it? Next one? That looks really nice. Mm -hmm. That's number five. I think I went to seven. Well, number six. I didn't fold it. You don't have to. Go on from one size to the next, you don't have to fold it. Okay. And if it comes out nice, you don't have to fold it and redo it on that side either. Just go to the next one. How's that look? That looks nice. Right, and this is number seven. Yeah, um, this is really thin. Mm -hmm. It's okay. That's good. Just leave her folded up. And we'll start on the next one. There's one number seven. Mm -hmm. okay. So it's three or four times on set and one, once on two, a couple of times on three. 
And then once on four and five and six and seven. Well, not every batch will be the same. When you do this other batch, it might work a little differently. This one's not even going you through. You have them on one? Yes, it's back on one. Push it a little flat. stretch here, pull it in half, see, hold that there, clean it up, paint it with water, it helps seal it up. Okay. Like this, don't press too hard, just enough so you can see circles. This is my little handy dandy Pampered Chef cut and seal. Press a little bit. They make very large red gills. Let's see what this does. Just so you can make little circle outlines so you know where to put your have a tablespoon. My filling is ground turkey. You can use ground sausage, Italian seasonings. A little bit of breadcrumb and mozzarella cheese. You can put any kind of filling you want in them. You take it, just put it right in the center. Smoosh that down. Right in the center. Take little domes. You don't really want it on the edge where you seal. It may not seal good. over everything. Okay, put it right there. Press. Give it a twist. Press. Twist. So you don't seal good like that. Can you move this over a little bit? And do it again. It'll seal. Should pick up, clean it out, pull off, pull off. 
Okay, head rest little. Big ravioli. Now my noodle recipe I just got from the pasta thing for the kitchen. This is the light meat recipe. Now this that's left over here, it get re it's gonna get reworked to make more of these. Little holes you can get a little water. Put them in, not making more mess. But all those. It's a pain in the butt and make a lot at once. Freeze them. You don't have to cook them before you freeze them. You can put them straight. You can This is not coming apart. I made a mess of it. That's when it gets really ran. Let me catch up. Okay. Yeah, if there's sticking because they're sitting there too long. Sticking. Leftover noodles mm -hmm. from the raviolis. Ran out of filling. So I just cut it into noodles. They don't get good with sausage straws off with it. Oh, yeah, it does sound good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like fall. Awesome. Bring some out so they don't dry together. When they're mostly dry, you can cut them. You can cut them after they're dry too. These are wheat and flour noodles? Light wheat. They have actually more regular white flour than wheat. Whole wheat. Alright. So. Alright. Well, over here we have the spaghetti sauce I have made. There's two jars of spaghetti sauce from the store oregano, garlic, onion powder, salt, pepper, basil. Heat it up. And then over there. raviolis and you cook them for about 10 minutes you boil them for about 10 minutes you say these are probably done I turned the heat back on, but he said turn it on. Okay. So uh, it's stop boiling. It's just yeah. not so. Yeah, it's 
fish one out and see if it's done. How do you know it's done? On a plate. Looks done. Let's put a little sauce on there. Some of the water is coming with it. Too much water coming with it? 